Welcome to St. Lucia Experience, recorded here on St. Lucia Beaches by Petrus Vivius and his favorite beach partet. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, it's Petrus Vivius here at Ingwe Beach with a beautiful, beautiful morning sunrise. Guys, let's see what we can do with the beach walk video today. Maybe a little bit of a town update. Just another couple of few seconds, bear with me. Beautiful sunrise. The ocean can't wash over, so it must bring the sand to build this peninsula wider. It must bring it around the corner. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So we're losing the battle against ocean-borne sediment, whether we have got the sandbar in place or not. Look at the build-up over there. That happens on high tide, but not from the ocean, from the push from this side. I'm learning, I'm learning. Just as I thought, um, ocean-borne sediment's not a problem. Yes, beautiful flamingos here at the mud banks. They're not going to be very exposed today because it's neap tide. So we won't, but it will be low tide around about 1 o'clock lunchtime. There's still a lot of water flowing out, but now Neptite is holding it back a lot. And that dissipation of energy it creates water retention in the estuary for the marine life to settle, but it also deposits a lot of sediment. Because there's no energy to wash the sediment. And because there's no management of the sediment, it's not always positive. Our Goliath Heron is around the corner amongst the reeds, but not here in the way I can video it. Beautiful bird to be able to photograph and video. I hope there's enough marine water retention here to um, be a safe haven for some of the smaller fish, the fry that needs to grow up. Hippo is a little bit unsettled with the tide going out strongly, although it's neap tight, the currents flowing out strong and they can't touch the bottom they want to get out of the channel onto the mud bank but it's not what they used to it's still a beautiful sight to see the hippos here all the birds shouting over my shoulder let's have a look at the young seagull
beautiful. This is so beautiful. The closest, the closest living relatives is manatee and then the next one up from manatee is the whales I missed what he was eating, he took it into the water Oh man What have we there? It doesn't look like a chicken, but the crows are feeding on it. Let's go and have a closer look. Ah, chicken it is! Oh well, happy eating crows. Weissman is hooked into a shed here. Just north of the estuary mouth, the first proper valley that you get, just around the corner. And it looks like a nice sizable one. Yeah! Underside and Wiseman is into another one. Bringing it softly so it doesn't get off the hook. Yo, that's a nice size. Let's been into another one. Nope, this one was a miss. work they don't come out by themselves okay, it's on you guys see the technique the rod tip high to get the shed to go, get the lure so they're biting on top and this one is kicking back, might be a foul look, might be a big one. It's a nice size one. I don't know if we get spinner sharks here, but right here on that color line, there's a shark jumping and spinning in the air, in the waves. 
I'll probably one get in the video. Ons reese rijer het ontwaak en opgedaag hier by die mond. Daar is hy in al sy glorie. Of sy, of hy. Ek denk nie, hy het die pruin nie aan probleem nie. Ek denk net, ek het die pruin nie aan probleem, maar wie is daar? Meneer of mevrouw, ek is nie seker nie. Goliath rijer wat is recht staan om te hengel. Hier by St. Lucia Estuary, Monding. Goliath here and standing ready to fish. He had St. Lucia Estuary map. Patience is a virtue. There's Mike. Thank you that you can see us, it's a bit warm here on the strand. He's going up over. Thank you Mike. At Vanti Stewart and Charters, while watching. Looking after the people here on the beach. bigger this time of the day you can't just use the size of the boat and they come through in sets not like the previous launch where they didn't come through in sets it's lined up nicely on the power, the channel is nice and deep, motors kicked in well to hear them roar. Getting the timing right is going to punch through that one. Over the next one, next one. And that's the launch. Happy hunting guys, enjoy the day. Hi guys, if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please click on the photo of me and Pardet and you'll be subscribed. It's absolutely for free. YouTube don't charge you a cent. That I don't charge you a cent. Everything is for free if you subscribe. So it helps sustain me and Pardet in St. Lucia and improve our quality of life. Thank you.